Hey everyone, it's Wheat Penguin, and we're going to be recreating Cave Story in Unity. And this is just a demo of what the final result is going to look something like. And um, yeah, I'm just going to get right into it. Okay, so we're going to be recreating Cave Story in Unity. And um, this is just the introduction episode. We're going to go over some stuff. So Cave Story is an action platformer that was made by Pixel. It's a basic platformer that also has guns, and these guns all have three different levels of power that are pretty unique, and we're going to be learning how to remake it. So what we're going to learn here is basically all the Cave Story specific elements, like weapons, Cave Story movement, jetpacks, mapping, UI, and enemies. Um, we're not going to be looking into stuff like non-Cave Story platforming, because there's tons of videos on YouTube for stuff like that. I personally followed Bracky's. Not Bracky, um, Sebastian Lag's video on that. So we're going to be starting on that base and then building up all the Cave Story specific stuff upon that. And this may not be exactly what we do. We may do more stuff than this. We may not get to everything on this list, but this is the general uh, goal for how we're going to go about this. Um, so you're going to need a basic to intermediate understanding of Unity and its interface as well as C Sharp programming. This is not a beginner's tutorial. You're going to need to know a little bit about what you're doing. In order to follow along um, for version there's the version up there at 2018.2.17 f1 or after so that's fine and mo and all of the resources that you'll need like the artwork sprites and backgrounds are in the starter pack and i'm going to link to that github <coughs> in the description so you just download the project files for episode zero and you'll have everything you need to follow along okay so when you open up the unity project it, it should look something like this where you have quote in the middle and a couple blocks over here in the environment right now we're just using um sprites for them later on we'll switch them out for tiles because they're a little bit more convenient for when we want to make maps um so this project is a pretty simple 2d platformer setup we have a player with a controller and a player script that we'll go over later um box collider there's just three new layers, backdrop player and obstacles. Obstacles are things that you can crash into. Um, there's the main camera and the pixel perfect camera. Pixel perfect camera just makes sure that even if we go to HD resolutions, the, the pixel resolution remains the same. Um, yeah, if any of your sprites are looking kind of weird, then just go to the folder and make sure that the pixels per unit is 16 the and the format for override is rgba 32 bit also make sure that the filter mode is point and if you do that then it should be fine and if we play it then what we'll get is this so you can jump around the controls are um z to jump and x to shoot although we can't shoot anything yet but those are just basic Cave Story controls and uh, the arrow keys to move. Um, so yeah, it's really basic. There's no animation. There's just a bit of movement and jumping and so variable jump height. Like if you hold it down, you go a tad bit higher. So that's going to be the end of this episode. Thanks for watching and subscribe to make sure that you catch the next episode where we're going to start getting into animation.